I got that first check for, for, for a feature on Murder Was The Case soundtrack, and it was 10 racks. Mm. And I was like, yeah, robberies probably won't be necessary <laughs> any longer, <laughs> as right. long as I stay hey. in the studio. Every day I wait to lay my life on the line. Juggling these streets, pick your feet on the line. Hustle to increase, put it all on the line. Help me spouse, family, freedom, walking yards on the line. Every day I wait for like my life on the line. Jungle in these streets, pick your feet on the line. Hustle to increase, put it all on the line. House to spouse, family, freedom, walking yards on the line. Every day on the line. Every day. You know, way the, the way the music is rap, gangster rap music, whatever you want to call it now, when we're talking about gangsterism, acts of violence, you're not just talking from mouth. Your past, you have exercised that. There's, there's a criminal background that you have. Most definitely. When the acts of violence, force and violence. Most definitely it is. So it's a difference between when you say something that somebody that's 22, 19, 18 say something. Now, some of them that did some shit, too. Okay, but we talk- imagine when we was 19 and 22. Anyway, for the... <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Uh, Thank you. Uh, but what I'm saying, not no one time, we're talking about repeated... Uh, we're talking about recidious behavior. Okay? I know you have recidious behavior. Uh, I, learned, I learned from looking and knowing you that you do have recidious behavior. This is where I got some of it from. From the streets, you were you were the streets here for me, mm-hmm. for me and all the BGs that looked up to the G homies. You was one of the G homies that we all looked up to. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Not nah, because we did, the rap thing wasn't even in, in the play. Mm, That's okay. I, I didn't know pre rap. It was pre rap. Yeah, because I didn't yeah. know the nigga rap. I, that was not something. I know that ain't what you know. That, yeah. that ain't what I know about. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. understand yeah. me? So this rap thing came. Some years later, and I was like, huh? He want to what? Oh, yeah, he did got to do with this. No, the, I didn't want to. It's, that's, that's what I'm doing. Well, no, I'm talking about then. Talking yeah, about then. No, but that was in the mind of people like it. Yes. Yeah, but. Yeah, that yeah. is not what, because we know, you You understand me, there was a time that. Line the, pressure. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Then but the, you had to be that where we from, or you had to get out the way, so. I wasn't planning on getting out the way, so. Yeah, you, you know. threw us for a loop when you said they talking about, you know, this was happening and da 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 da. Huh? Yeah. Rap. Once he got on that pen, you, you it, was, time it, to it, do was, that? It, it was a different story once you started putting that pen in that paper. Yeah, that was a song. Uh, I remember I was with some other, some of our homeboys and they had pulled me up to uh, to a spot that 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 we had, right? And I uh, went to this spot, right there, blah, blah, blah. And, so one of the homies, he was, he was a homie, but he wasn't from the set. But he was a homie. Mm-hmm. And he came out with a cassette tape with some the metal. Old school. Yeah, it was a cassette tape with some metal on it looking. I ain't never seen that cassette before. And it, it was some songs that he had done. I think it was, uh, I got count times I went out of jail. So I got to go through it like that. It was, uh, I think it was, uh, was the murder was that a, much time. Yeah, 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 okay. But the murder was the case. <laughs> that was many times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. But I think it was one Jump Street. That's what it was? Yeah. Okay. No, uh, no, no. But he been doing stuff way before that. Where did you do it? Well, demos. Before, 20, before murder was the case, I think I might have did uh, dropping bombs on the show soundtrack, but yeah. I'm not sure which came first. Okay. But. You know, that yeah. was that was like the debut, though. That was the the big debut. Right. You see, when I got twisted up on that that case, then you had the Twenty One Jump Street. I heard that. And I was in Linwood in the Crip Module over the radio, mm-hmm. and the whole module went up. Oh, oh yeah. Oh man, that, went yeah, up. Twenty One right. Jump Street is. I, but uh, I had yeah. A, yeah, but I had heard it with them with him. So I was like, yeah, I don't know how that's gonna work. But no, he don't want to do no more robberies. And they had told me one day, I ain't doing no more robberies, cuz. <laughs> I was like, damn, D, what? How you gonna live? So you gotta think, we talking about many years ago, right. when I was super ignorant, didn't understand life. This is what he told mm-hmm. me, and, and he was really stuck on rapping. But again, uh, you just, that the homie going, he gonna do that, I'm gonna go do what I'm gonna do. I end up in jail, 21 Jump Street's on the live with yeah. on, the, on, the, on, the, on the TV. Uh, on the radio, because we used to listen to the radio through the TV right, and the right. module and shit, right? 
Then I went to jail. I think uh, you uh, the show soundtrack. That was another yeah. that came out when I was in jail. I think I was in Calipatria when that came out. He was on and that and too. I, yeah, see, I didn't know that, too, but I had to call VIP. We used to get the, uh, tapes from mixtapes from VIP. Right. So I would call the hood and get my tapes sent to me, like everybody else sent to the pen. That's when I heard he was on there. When I uh, I knew he was buzzing, but. I was on my top bunk when that single you hit called uh, I Be The Hardest. Mm. And I was on that my- That was an underground <laughs> classic right there. Yeah. 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 You know what Shout I'm talking about? Shout out to my boy, was, uh, 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 Butter. Yeah, I was yeah, sitting on my top bunk that. when I came on, and I'm hitting the bottom like, you know, when you when you got a song on, you hit, you, know, you do this, that means some fire on the radio. So I'm hitting the bottom like, hey, man, and you was, you know, you was going hard. So when you made that transition from hanging with this dude, <laughs> to push in your pants. What was in your mind? Like, man, I, you know, I can do this, or I been knew I could do this, or what, you know, what made you do that? Well, I knew, granted, the opportunity from me writing behind the wall and, you know, not really auditioning, but rehearsing my shit in front of the homies, and they was like, oh, you know, the reaction I was getting mm. from them. I was like, okay, I might can do this shit. So, you know, when I heard Dog was doing what he was doing, before I got out, I was like, one of the homies is on from Long Beach shit. I'm getting on. So that was just my mindset. Mm -hmm. And it manifested, and you know, I got that, uh, I got that first check for, for, for a feature on Murder Was The Case soundtrack, and it was 10 racks, mm. and I was like, yeah, robberies probably won't be necessary <laughs> any longer. He's as right. long as I stay hey. in the studio. Every day I wake for like my life on the night. Jungle in these streets, beat the beats are on the night. Hustle to increase, put it all on the night. House to spouse, family, freedom, walk in yards on the night. Every day, on the night. Every day, 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 every day. On the line, every day, every day, on the line.